Okay, blessings and good evening, everybody. We're having a community calendar, fire starters. We have Andrew and Angelica Mendoza, and they're going to speak about an event that actually we're going to step into. So yeah. we'll make sure you get their information. And uh, you want to connect with us on this, then uh, we'll make sure that you can get a hold of them to uh, begin this whole movement of uh, reaching every person in our community for Jesus Christ. So, so Andrew, thank you, and Helica, thank you so much yes. for coming. And uh, thank you for I'll go us. ahead and thank you. and uh, just share your heart, brother. Amen. Amen. It's, I don't even know where to begin. Um, you know, it, it's we're in a time and place where the city of Madeira is going to experience the glory of God. You know, the presence of God. You know, it's church isn't just in the four walls anymore we get shepherd in here we get sharpened but it's time to go out and release the presence of jesus you, you know I, I feel a burning in my heart that it, there, there's just so much going on in Madera, california mm -hmm. the enemy's trying to find out how to attack us but it's not working you know it, it's it's the days where hospitals are great, doctors are great, you know, don't get me wrong, but there's going to be a time where Believer's Church of Madeira and God's been burning this in my heart, you know, there's going to be a line outside of the door just for prayer. Wow. Exactly. You, you know, there's, there, there's going to be lines here to where they cry out for healing, you know, physical, emotional the full 360 you know people are going to want to experience jesus people are going to want to experience the freedom that we have yeah you, you know there, there's there's something about seeking jesus and something that's going to get released that's it, it's going to be awesome I, I don't even know how to explain it right now <laughs> no. you, you know it's the presence of god it, it's only going to increase you know, it's only going to increase, and I want to see people get healed instantly. I want to see tumors disappear. Yes. I want to exactly. see arms, legs grow out. You know, that's that's what's burning in my heart. Yes. You know, the arms, legs, fingers, ears. <laughs> you, Everything. You, you know, you, you we have to go out with childlike faith. You know, and that, that's, that's what God's been talking to me about. As soon as we start, starting tomorrow at 10, 10 a.m., you, you know, we have to come expecting that something's going to happen. Yes. yes. You know, and when we come expecting, He meets 80% of the way. We just have to come with the faithfulness. Yeah. We have to come with the willingness. We have to come with a spirit of boldness to yeah. reach the lost. Yes. You know, it, it, it's it's gonna be awesome. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. You, you know, and the di divine reconnect. Reconnect. Yes. Reconnect. You, you know, God's been talking to me about that. That when you hosted that, it, all the walls broke down. All the walls broke down for us to go out in the street, for not only us but the churches of Madeira to go out and. Yes. Yeah. to really release the gospel you know don't don't like i tell other people don't make it harder than what it is yeah. you know just get in his presence and see what he wants you to do see what that's he right. wants you to that's say right. that's right see what he wants you to release you know all it's it's going to be powerful yeah yeah it's it's really going to be powerful and i'm believing that a lot of people that are lost right now in Madera, California, they're going to come home. They're going to come home, not only them, but their families. Yes. You know, not only their families, but their friends. You know, and e even, even as Angelica and I and everybody who attends, even if we, as we lead and preach the simplicity of the gospel, you know, even if we don't get them saved, we planted that seed. Yeah. We planted that seed yeah. so somebody else could water. Yeah, come on. You know, it's a team effort, and all glory, all praise goes to God because 
he's getting ready to shake Madera, California, oh, and he yes, is yes. ready. Yes. You know, yes, it's, it's yes. just, we need to go out and do it. Yes. You know, and it's... The harvest is ready. It's time. Yes. It's time. Yes. Because the, the people that don't know Jesus, they're seeking for help even though they don't realize it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know, and we're, we're the ones that are supposed to go out and do the works of Jesus. You know, I don't want to just experience Jesus. I want to touch Jesus. Yeah. You know, and I want other people to touch Jesus. Yeah. You know, and I want their family members to come, you know, and I want them to experience the presence of God, the power, the glory, the freedom that we're experiencing right now. Yeah. Exactly. You know, yes, and thank you, Lord. We're, we're going to get guided. We're going to get guided. Our angels, yeah. our army of angels are going to go out. You know, and they're gonna fight the battles for us. You know, and we're we're just we're excited of what's gonna happen of in the year of 2018. You know, this is the year, the year of the evangelist. Exactly, exactly. This this, this is the year of increase. Mm -hmm. Yes. Increase yeah. in giftings. Number eight. Increase mm -hmm. of our faith walk. You you know, this is the year of. The lost coming home, and this is the start of something very huge. You know, it, it, it's this. This is the start of something great. The, it, it's it's. It's just being open to it and going out. Exactly. Just volunteering and going out, and they're going to be blessed. Yeah. Whoever goes, so double yeah. portions for them too. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not. It's not that. Uh, if I'm getting you right here, it's not that we're just going out because we want to see miracles happen. We're going out to love people because they need a miracle. Exactly. And 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 there's a difference between looking for the miracle and wanting to love people. Yeah. And so this is the this is the year. This is the season of great love and great mercy. And. Um, uh, being in that season, God is raising you two up in this time. Yeah. And uh, we've been, we've been uh, those of us that are a little in the gray, uh, you know, we've been praying a long time. We've been praying for the youth for a long time. We've been asking God for this to happen. And it's happening. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's happening. Amen. Amen. And, and there's been many other prophecies. There's been other visions. Some of us in this town have had the same vision about uh, Madera High's football field being filled with people just with their hands lifted praising God. Mm -hmm. Many people have had that vision. There's some of us that have visions of people driving down the freeway and I, I always see the picture of that 4th Street overpass and okay. people are just pulling over because the presence of God is so strong they have to pull over and try to figure out what it is. They got to get out of their car. Amen. Wow. And, and so it, we're, this is beginning, you know, I, mm -hmm. I, I kind of gauge everything and I know all kinds of other powerful things have happened before April yeah. the 7th. But for me, I'm gauging everything from April the 7th, what's happening from that day. And we're seeing this happen. And, um, you know, I, I'm not uh, I'm not at all uh, um, <laughs> concerned about about what the enemy is doing and it's like uh, it's like I expected for some things like this to happen like I just we just heard yesterday that there was a bill that passed the first step in our state senate to try mm. to stop people from preaching the gospel yeah I and bibles and things and so I, I you know I expect the devil to attack to do yeah. something and, and that just tells us that yeah God is making a way for us because he's going to try to hinder it he's going to try to stop mm -hmm. it but he ain't going to win he's not he's not <laughs> he's not going to um, win this this past this past week or so it's kind of funny how the enemy's trying to get us off track it's we paid our rent on time we paid it early you know it's we paid our rent i got a text from the landlord last thursday we haven't received your rent you know and i'm like okay okay great great you know we went to the post office and they said they couldn't find it. Hmm. I'm like, okay, so how are we gonna come up with the money? You know, I started re almost, almost starting to go into my flesh and bad thoughts happening, you, you, you know, and immediately I heard the voice of God, don't worry, I'm gonna take care of you. I'm like, okay, 
Take okay. your daddy. <laughs> let, let me, exactly. <laughs> let, let me take a couple deep breaths. You know, I took a couple deep breaths, talked to them kindly, exited. We were driving back to Angelica's parents' house, and I heard it again. I'm your father. Don't worry. I'm going to take care of you. Right? I'm like, okay. Okay, Lord, I give it all to you. You know, I, I just felt peace come over me. You know, and moments later, I called our landlord, and she was like, oh, don't worry about it. We'll be praying for you. The money will return. I'm like, wow. I, I didn't even know my... My landlords were yeah, we're believers. Be we're believers. We're believers, <laughs> you know. And I come to realize that the enemy he'll try and really get you off track. Really. Get you off track yeah. on what God wants you oh, to yeah. do, and God will immediately say, like, "I appointed you for this. Don't worry. I'm a provide the finances. I'm a provide." everything that you need right there on the table you know don't yes. worry on what pretty much like don't worry what people think about you you know don't worry about what's going to happen what the enemy has planned against you because i love you you know and i'm really understanding the love of jesus that he has for me the love of god and what he's showing me a little glimpse of the love that he has for me, he wants us to spread it out towards Madera, California. You know, and then those people will spread it out to Fresno, to Merced. Chowchilla. Chowchilla. <laughs> you, you know, it's... Let's not forget. The, the, en the enemy attacks, but it, it's... They know. It, it's this. becoming, like, really? You know, it's not really an attack, it's a sense of an attack. Yeah. That's what because it is. Because God already has the answer. But to us, it looks like in the middle of that storm, it looks like, uh-oh, like he's going to win or something here. Or mm -hmm. he's going to really cause some... And all he's trying to do is just get us messed up. Like you said, you start yeah. getting your flesh. That's where he wants us to go. He wants you to leave that peaceful spiritual realm and go in the flesh, see? Yeah. And then sooner or later, the longer we stay in the flesh, the next thing you know, we start thinking, well, maybe I shouldn't do this Saturday. i got to take care of my rent. And, you know, maybe mm -hmm. I shouldn't this, maybe I shouldn't that. So however he wants to trip us up, Mm -hmm. However, he knows that he thinks he can trip us up. That's where he always comes at us, you know. Exactly. But exactly. you know, the, the the great thing is we know that that when God speaks to you like that, that's powerful. Now, yeah. I know there's many people that uh, in my life that have said, "How do you hear from God?" You know, and I, and I think you got His Spirit in you. You know, yeah. I mean, <laughs> you should hear from Him. <laughs> but you know, anyway, I can't judge that, or I, I don't understand it for them. But I only know how it works for me. You know how it works for you, and, yeah. and you know, so. So let's uh, let's uh, let's jump to the um, uh, the techniques and the timing and all this. But people are going to meet here. We're going to spend what I think you said a half hour here, and then yes, kind of let everybody know what we're going to do. So if they want to come and join us, they know what to expect. Okay. So my wife and I, my wife Angelica and I, we're going to be introducing on what pretty much what we're doing today. You know, foundation of scripture. Isaiah 61, we're going to be standing on that for street evangelism, yeah. double portion, you know, mm -hmm. double portion of the anointing and so forth. You, you know, it, it's, we're going to explain the foundation of where this ministry, ministry is starting. You know, and after we explain, we're going to go ahead and get into intimacy. Mm -hmm. You know, really hear where the Holy Spirit wants us to impact Madeira for the first day. You know, about... Maybe he wants us to go for 15 minutes. Maybe he wants us to go for half an hour, 45 minutes, you know. And after that, we're going to get into groups. Groups, depending how many, many people show up, get into groups of three and four, three or four, and really impact the marketplaces, the parks. And wherever the Holy Spirit wants us to go, we're going to go. Yes, amen. You know, it's, it's going to be awesome. Yes. Now we're going to come back and we're going to um, talk about what happened. Okay. Just yeah. Debrief give each flight, other. Huh? Yeah. Yeah. Give each other. Well, yeah. we're really going to tell all the testimonies. Right? Yes. Exactly. <laughs> yes. And so we, we all want to take a little recorders with us so we can record all of it and not forget anything. There's going to be so much. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. <laughs> exactly. And the, the, this is the first day, you know, it's the first day we're thinking about doing it twice a month. 
Okay. You know, and as the Lord leads us, maybe we'll do it every Saturday. You know, or maybe yeah. three times. Every other. Yeah. Maybe it all three times. On the schedules. It, it all what depends. We can do. You know, it all depends on who's gonna attend and their schedule. I want to be flexible enough to where everybody could attend. Sure. Sure. You know, and yeah. just go out. No, great idea. Yeah, it's, you know, <laughs> some people can come on certain times and some yeah. can't, you know, so if you give them a few options, then, you know. It works um, out. Yeah, that works, usually works exactly. out a lot better. That way, maybe you don't get everybody all at one time, but you get enough each time. Mm -hmm. you know? Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. And really what it boils down to when God calls us into ministry, even if nobody else goes with us, we still got to do what he's called us to do. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And uh, I, I know that... Uh, we like to have large gatherings because we love our brothers and sisters in the body of Christ, you know, from all walks of life, of mm -hmm. Christianity. And we like to get together and we like to do big, uh, major, you know, settings together of seeking the Lord and worship and, you know, whatever goes along with it for that particular program of that day. But, but when we're going out in the streets, it's a, you know, it's a different, if it's a whole different ball game. Yeah. Because yeah. we're, we're just going out in the streets now. Yeah, and exactly. We're applying what yeah. we learn. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. I'm ready. Well, awesome. thank you, Andrew. Thank you, Angelica. Yes, thank you. This is another fire starters community <laughs> calendar. Praise God. We, that, that means that things are moving and shaking in Madeira. But, so yeah. anyway, God bless you all. Thank you for tuning in with us. Again, how can they contact you if... Uh, they want to call you to be here i'll go ahead and put my number on there okay and um, okay go ahead and feel free to text me call me okay and we'll go from there okay yeah and so um the lord's speaking to you if your heart's pumping right now come on over here and be mm. a part of this because it's going to be great amen it's going to be awesome so god bless you we love you and good night